Hey guys. Alright, so I don't have anything planned for this video. I just wanted to kind of like just hit record and talk about my year. So it is the end of 2013. We're going into 2014. So I just want to talk about my year. So I don't know if there's like a tag going around or if anyone else is doing this. I just wanted to come and talk about all the things that I've experienced this year. So this is the year. I feel like I've found myself more this year. Um, you know, all the I'm like job wise, all the other jobs I had, they were very poor paying. Like the jobs I have now, I'm making so much money and I love it. I love being a server. So it's like my favorite, you know, it's like the best job I've ever had. Um, before I was living like check to check and like I was just freaking poor. And now I'm saving up for my dream car. So I'm really excited about that. So, I really love being a server. I work at two different places. I work at a breakfast place and I work at a dinner place. And most weekends, I work both places a day. Like, I work, like, Friday morning, Saturday night, or Friday morning, Friday night. Friday, like, Saturday morning, Saturday night. Like, I work both jobs. So, in, like, you know, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, I work six different shifts. Like, it's very busy. My weekends don't exist, so... My weekends kind of suck, but I make a lot of money. So I love being a server. I love it. I recommend it to everyone. Everyone who asks me, I'm like, be a server, be a server. Like, I love being a server. So 2013 is the year that I became a server. I think it was like February. I became a server. I was trained to be a server at my first job. Um, and I will not do anything else. Right now, I'm loving it. Probably later on in life, but right now, I love being a server. So if you follow my Instagram, I post a lot of like server life, server problems, server everything. I'm very proud of it. Like anyone who asks me, I'm like, oh, I'm a server. Server. Don't call me a waitress. Oh, I hate that. I yelled, I yelled at this new girl that I work with on my breakfast job because she called me a waitress. I was like, wait, what did you just call me? She's like, waitress? I said, your waitress will be right with you? I'm like, no, 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 no. I am not a waitress. I am a server. Uh, she's like, oh, well, you know, where I was trained, we just called them waitresses and waiters. I'm like, how long ago? Like, you just took me back, like, 50 years. I'm like, I'm a server. Like, I don't need people calling me a waitress. I, I just, I hate that term. It's just like, I almost consider it, like, a derogatory term. Like, oh, waitress. Waitress. Wait. No. I'm a server. Server. I love it. Server life. I'm all about that server life. Yeah, so, you know, I make a lot of money being a server. So I just recommend it to everyone. So that's pretty much all I've talked about so far. Um, I've watched WWE this entire year. I've gone to three different events this year. I love it. I'm so deep into it. I got this, I pre-ordered this Gold Dust shirt um, in, like, freaking early December. And I still haven't gotten it. They're like, oh, it's back ordered. I freaking pre-ordered that shirt. So I'm kind of annoyed about that. But I'm very happy with my uh, wrestling shirt collection. Uh, I need to find more people that I can speak like WWE with. People, like a lot of people are just like, they don't get it. Or some people even still throw around the shit like, oh, you know, it's fake, right? Uh, fucking duh. Obviously I know it's fake. That's what makes it entertaining. So I love that. Um, so I'm... I'm into wrestling. Um, loving the server life. I'm, I'm saving up for my dream car right now, guys. I'm like nowhere near having enough money, but I'm saving up. So before I wasn't even able to save up anything ever. So I'm saving up for that, and I'm very excited to one day reach my goals and get my car. See my jacket? I'm like inside of my house right now, but I'm like, ugh, I don't want to wear. A t-shirt, so I just threw on a scarf and my jacket, just because this is what I want to look like right now. Um, but yeah, so I just got off work at my dinner job. I think everyone already knows I work at Olive Garden. Uh, yeah, I work at Olive Garden, my dinner job. So I just got off work, and I decided to come home, and I wanted to hang out with my friend, my best friend, but she is, she's with her man right now, so... I decided I'd film a video and talk about my year. Yeah, I haven't, I pretty much stayed at the same weight 
weight wise I haven't done anything different my New Year's resolutions I have no idea what I want to do I wanted to do something you know health wise because you know everyone does that maybe like cut out processed foods or like cut out fried foods or something like that I don't like the processed foods anyway but just you know on my Friday Saturday Sunday shifts where I literally have no freak I come home Okay, I wake up at like 6 a.m. to get ready to go to work at like 8 a.m. And then I come home and then I change and then I go to my other job. So I don't even have time to like eat real food, to like sit here and make a real meal. So I eat at work, which is pretty bad. But I try to eat like as healthy as I can. So I cook everything dry, no oil, egg whites. Like I try to make it as healthy as I can, but you know, it's still not healthy. But... I'm going to try to make it a little bit healthier. I just want to cut out fried food. I eat too many fried foods. I don't know. I'll figure out resolutions. I'll probably post them on Instagram. But yeah, what else have I done? I don't know. Do you see my eyes? I wear eyelashes like every single day now. These are the Red Cherry number 47s. My best friend... I uh, got me into these. She bought like a whole bunch of them and she gave me a pair. She's like, oh, try these. You'll love them. And like I tried them and I did. I love them. I was using um, some like synthetic ones that I got on eBay. And like I didn't like them because they were so shiny. Like they're plastic. So they were just so shiny and they looked so fake. And so these are, you know, human hair, and they're wispy, so it's not like it's like one solid um, lash line of just it lashes. Like, it's it looks, these are very long, but they look more natural than the ones I was wearing before. So I really like these lashes. What else? I fell very deeply in love with leopard print. Uh, I pretty much own every accessory you can own in leopard print. I fell head over heel, heels in love with the color gold, mainly because of gold dust. Everything's gold dust inspired now, but I love gold accessories now. Like I want a gold purse, and I if I could have like a gold foil mirrored scarf, I would. I used to like okay, like I got into scarves this past month. My best friend was like, "You need a scarf." Like she's been telling me about scarves for like ever. She wears scarves, and I was like, "Oh, they're cool, whatever." Like I never thought about them. And then, like, I saw this cute one. We were at Kohl's, and she's like, oh, you should buy it. And I'm like, nah, it's okay. And then, like, I went back to buy it later on because I had a coupon, and it wasn't there. This other print one. Do I have it here? Hold on. So they didn't have the leopard print. So I got this, like, uh, damask print scarf. And then um, I really wanted leopard. It was leopard. And then I couldn't find it. So I went to the mall and I got this leopard infinity scarf. And then I went back to Kohl's and they had this this uh, style in leopard print. <laughs> so I bought it. So I have two leopard print scarves. So I don't ever wear this one now. So I don't know what to do with it. I put it on my dog every now and then just because it's funny and he looks great in the scarf. So yeah. Um, that's pretty much all I do. Well, it's all pretty much I do. I wear scarves now. I wear a lot more leopard print. Um, like earlier, not earlier, but like when I was in high school and like 18, 19, I was so into zebra print. And then this one fucking bitch killed it for me. Zebra print was so cute until she ruined it. So now, and then I like started hating zebra print and started fucking despising everything zebra print. Everything that I had zebra print in my house, I like got rid of and like. I don't think it's cute anymore. It's not my favorite print. You know, leopard's my favorite print. And don't confuse leopard with cheetah. They're not the same. Cheetah is just spots. Leopard has its own, like, different texture. See? It's, they're different. Yeah, this video is pretty much just me rambling, talking about my year. About loving, being a server and loving it and stuff like that. Um, but yeah. Um, this year I'm also trying to get my hair too white. My jobs are pretty chill, so I can probably go to, like, platinum, purpley, gray, white, and they'd probably not care. Like, I'm getting away with wearing these plugs. My old job, they didn't even let me wear plugs, and now I'm getting away with these. I just wanted to come on and talk to you guys and say have a happy 
New Year. Happy 2014.